welcome. I am uh, doing this video to ask you guys a question. I do use PHP as a server-side uh, scripting language on uh, a lot of my web servers, uh, and I know just the bare minimum of it. I use it to read things and write things to files, and of course, uh, MySQL database stuff, uh, and also sometimes SQLite databases, depending on what I'm doing. Um, but I know the bare minimum of it, and of course, if you do things wrong, it can cause uh, vulnerabilities on your system. So I have a simple question for those of you out there who may uh, be more familiar with PHP than I am. So I'm in a directory here in my uh, web directory called phpq for a PHP question. And right now it's an empty directory, but I'm going to create an index file here and I'm going to write a PHP script, a very simple one here. In fact, I'm going to use a, a template that I, I've created that uh, I use quite often. Um, Oops. And it's this PHP get form. So basically it's going to uh, retrieve, well, I'll show you. Let me just save it, uh, go to my web browser here, and it's a blank page if you don't pass it anything. But now I can pass it stuff like name equals Bob. If I do that, it says name is Bob. And I can add other variables in here. Uh, as you can see, uh, I did a little example of this earlier. Uh, phone equals 555, 555, 5555, and address is 123 Maple Ave. And basically it's just, what it's doing here is it's taking any variable passed there in the URL and it is stripping tags and uh, you converting things, encoding it with uh, HTML special characters here, pu putting all that back into that array and then slipping through the array here and echoing out the key and the value for each one. So my question to you is uh, this, what else would you do? Would you do anything else to sanitize, to clean up this to prevent, uh, you know, different types of attacks uh, that people might do on the web server? Or do you think this is enough? I really don't know a lot about this. This is what I normally use, and but I see things where there are functions for sanitizing for different things, but uh, it seems like they're, um, you have to pass it each individual um, item and in the, in the tutorials I looked at where this I'm pa giving it an array and it's piping it back overwriting that array originally I would like something like that so um, yeah uh, in the comments below you know if you know about this don't don't put code if you can unless it's like one or two lines in the comments try to use paste bin or something equivalent to that and paste it in there but any advice from you guys would be great you know I, I do a lot of tutorials for you guys maybe you guys can teach me something because again my PHP skills are minimal I basically do the same things over and over again and I have templates that I've created like this one here for common things so like I said this is just echoing things back but that sounds when I dump stuff into um, uh, databases I start off with this and then I loop through each item and dump it into the database or retrieve it from the database depending on whether I'm entering stuff or, or retrieving stuff. So let me know what you think. Is this code good? Do you think this is good enough? Is there something you would suggest to secure it more, sanitize it more? I'd appreciate it and I look forward to your comments. Let me know and I thank you for your time and I hope that you have a great day.